Yo, what is up, guys? Today, I'm going to show you how to make a 3D next spot. I'm sorry for that cringy voice. I just don't know how to make a good voice, how to do it. But, um, yeah. Uh, I'll take my time here because I rushed from the previous video or the... I don't think. I just deleted the video, but, like, yeah, I did. I did it too fast. First off, you got to put a next spot. Just type next spot. It works with any uh, next spot. I tested it out. I'm not sure if it works for like this other one because it has like different mecha mechanics and then like um uh, then like just get a mesh just get any next spot you, j you want just get any next spot get a mesh like any mesh if you want any mesh and then just put mesh part take it to the head and then you're gonna need this um the, you're gonna need this whale constraint. Don't know how you say it, but like, yeah, this will like make carry the the little the, the carry the mesh part. So put part zero for head, then part part one for mesh part. Then you're gonna see this green square, which is gonna indicate that it's working. So now just double click enabled, and then active should just start going. Now it if well. It's gonna be obvious, but just take away the image. You can either take it to the trash or like just put the transparency to one. And let's test it out. I don't think it's gonna show you the gameplay. Well, I don't know why. I'll try to figure that out. Boy, this is worse than the time I was shush. Oh, yeah, it was definitely green. Boy, let me tell you, he was eyeing that drip yep. the whole time. Caught him in the act. Yep, he, yeah, it works. It works. Yeah, it, if you didn't see my gameplay, I don't think it, it would give you, show you my gameplay. I don't know, probably it's too bugged, but it did work. So just try it out and have fun making your own next spot, 3D next spot. Bye.